Right here, folks, I'm here at a lake and uh, I'm gonna go overnight camping here. And uh, it's a place I lived when I was a kid and I uh, thought I'd come check it out. I haven't been here for a while, so uh, we'll see how it goes. This is in the wheat belt of Western Australia and this lake's usually dried up, but we had a lot of rainfall this winter. So uh, I thought I'd come down because I heard it had filled. So these are old trees that were, well this lake was once a freshwater lake and because of the clearing of the land for farming, the salt levels rose. And this is now a salt lake. So pretty much everything that lived in it died, including the trees. I hope that looks as good on the camera as what it does to me looking at it. This here looks like a good spot to camp. It looks pretty flat. And I think I'm gonna get the wave in. Yeah. So it's 5.30 in the morning and I'm just getting up now. Um, it's been windy all night, like full on windy. It's died down a little bit now, but it's still, it's still a bit choppy. I definitely had my tent pegged down last night just so that it wouldn't blow away. But there's not much around here. Still a windy day today. Uh, it was really windy last night and it stayed windy today. So probably not the best day for kayaking, but um, I'll see what happens and uh, should be good. So I'm done, and uh, just as there's a lot of flies around, just as a bit of bonus footage, I bought my bike with me as well, not just my kayak. And so um, I'm gonna get that. And there's apparently a hill up there. So we're gonna ride up that hill, and we're gonna see what's up there. This is really quite elevated, really pretty place actually. And you can see all the wheat, these are wheat crops. And they're the beans over there. But this is mainly wheat farms here. All right, that's my trip done. Hope you enjoyed it.